Entrepreneurs are change makers. Um, they change people's lives, they change customers' lives, employees' lives, they change their families' lives. I mean, they're in, in the, good entrepreneurs are in, in the business of change. Most entrepreneurs, when they go into business, um, quite often anyway, are go in against, as a reaction against something. They, they see something that they could do better, do differently, and so therefore they want to change it. And this is quite often the first step um, between what I would suggest between being you know, just a small business owner and actually being a genuine entrepreneur. So entrepreneurs are very much in the business of change. Now, if you take a look at our wider society at the moment, which is to some degree in the economic doldrums, um, in a recessionary sort of climate, the need for people who can change things has never been more important. So the ability to sort of say, I can take that, I can improve it, I can make it better, I can grow it better, I can employ more people to do it, is part of what the Prime Ministers call the doers and the grafters, the people that do, do change things. So I think there's never been a better time to be an entrepreneur than now. Now, now is the time to be an entrepreneur because your ability to change is disproportionately more important in a downturn. Um, and the importance of that is disproportionately um, more significant because, of course, what you're doing is, is that you're creating the changes that are about revival and renewal. So I actually think that um, every small drama that an entrepreneur is going through is part of a bigger play, which is about the economic recovery of this country, which is going to be built on small companies. It's going to be built on entrepreneurs that take the risk to go for it in the initial period because you know that's an unreasonable thing to do to believe you can do it for yourself that then actually say well you know what i can take on a bigger competitor and beat them so you grow and every part of that that sort of journey is basically punctuated by change and i think it's when you lose the urge for change um, that you start to see businesses stagnate and you start to see if you like the beginning of the end i think that kind of fascination and love affair with change is a really important part of what makes great businesses continue to evolve, continue to be re relevant to their customers and also make them exciting and exciting places to be and exciting places to work.